Welcome back to the channel, I'm Arjun, and I'm going to be doing another vegan food review today. So that of course is the main thing I do on my channel, so here is another one. Now I'm going to be doing one, one of my favourite types of things to review, which is ice cream. It's always nice to get a good ice cream, I suppose. I mean, I haven't had many for a while, you know, since most ice creams are based on dairy. But there are some good ice creams coming out, just like this one I'm going to review today. What have we got here? Brand new one from Wees. Looks uh, fairly promising so far, I think. What has we got here? Um, boysenberry, acai, and coconut. Oh, is that acai? Yeah, sorry. Boysenberry, acai, and coconut. So, I mean, looks pretty good. The. Oh, no, second. Someone on my camera. Okay. So, uh, yeah, I said it looks pretty good. Boysenberry ice cream was actually one of my favourite ice creams when I was younger. I liked this and I liked um, mint. I think that was my two favourite ones. So I'd be interested to see how this uh, comes up. Hopefully I'm not looking for too strong of a coconutty sort of flavour, but I suppose with Sarex there. And it'd be interesting to see if you can sort of taste the boysenberry and acai. So that'd be interesting to look at. So of course, um, Australian made, it's vegan. Looks pretty good. What have you got in here? Vegetable gums, acai puree, coconut paste, pomegranate juice, blueberries. Yeah, just some basic stuff. Let's get straight into it. So, open it up. I've reviewed, whatever I've reviewed before, this Wheeze brand. I think they're, they're bars, I suppose. And like I said, they've got full tub of ice cream. They've got uh, a chocolate and coconut and a plain coconut. But this, look, look at this one. Let me just. Uh, looks pretty good. Look at that. Definitely looks like boysenberry. You've got the white, you've got the uh, purpley pink sort of colour. Let's try it out. Hmm. It's not strong. Try some of the, uh, what is this? The boysenberry part of its own. Not strong. I mean, I can definitely taste the acai because uh, that has a you know a sort of distinct sort of flavour. It's not strong, but I'm not really picking up much boysenberry. That's supposed to be like a nice tart sort of flavour, which is why it goes really nice to cut against sort of like a sweet vanilla ice cream. So not incredible on that part. I mean, I try the coconut by itself. Hmm. Yeah, coconut's not bad. I mean, a little bit coconutty, but not too coconutty. Probably one more bit together. I mean, let's see here. Yeah. It's not as punchy as I'd hope it to be. The, the ice cream bars I had were really sort of punchy. This is like a very subtle sort of flavor. So kind of a letdown just on their own part because their other ice creams are really punchy. But versus other, ice cream, especially the vegan ice creams. This is pretty good because it's not overly sweet or anything like that. Uh, things like, um, uh, who makes that? I think it's Ben and Jerry's. Ben and Jerry's vegan ice cream is terribly sweet. So to get one that's like not very sweet, has a nice, you know, mellow sort of flavor, but you know, nice sort of flavor. That's pretty good. But I like what it looks like. It looks pretty cool. I mean, makes something nice, something, di something a bit different. But yeah, I mean, if you're after, I mean, they're the only one I've ever seen of vegan sort of boysenberry ice cream, which there should be more because it's a berry, but anyway, um, should be interesting to look at. So if you're after something a little different, that's something good to look at, uh, boysenberry, acai and coconut ice cream. Um, only sold in Australia, I think. I'm not actually 100% sure on that, but I think it is. But if you can get this, something worth looking at because it's pretty good, it's not like, Wow, this is incredible, but it probably is worth picking up. So, check this one out.